I was mm-hmm. almost racist, if that's even possible, to a fellow Punjabi person. It's just a really weird situation. Yeah, really weird. So I was at work today. This happened today. And uh, so this is my non-hospital medical work. And this guy came in and uh, started speaking to him. And uh, he seemed to speak Punjabi. So then I was like, okay, I'll speak Punjabi as well. So we had this whole like 20, 25 minute assessment in Punjabi, which is fine. His Punjabi is very good. He understood what I was saying. Da, da, da. So then I got to the end and I was like, Paji, to see... Uh, I was like, where are you from? And he's like, you know, Wolverhampton. And then uh, I was like, no, no, no. You see, where are you from? And he's like, where are you from? I India. And he's like, no, no, no. I'm born here. And I was like, oh, right. So you speak English? He's like, yeah. So then we both realized after ages. And I was like, oh my God, this is like the royal family situation. I'm doing like a that one of those ones and uh yeah it was just, it was just really i always funny. knew you were a bloody uncle chum inside honestly yeah man it's like god why is he a thing i knew you had it in you mm. but the thing is it's not uncommon a lot of people i see are actually they do come originally from there they're living here and they they, they sound like this but this guy's punjabi was just so good he was like yeah i get that a lot people just think i'm fresh and uh i was like it's probably a compliment man because your punjabi is actually that good <coughs> and then he was talking about how a lot of our generation, same age, our generation, you know, UK kids, the Punjabis, maybe not as fluent because maybe they've not had that exposure. Um, mm. But it's just so funny, man. But it's just so funny. We're both like, yeah, we can have a conversation in English as well and that would be completely fine at the end of this whole thing. It's, it's just a really funny situation, man. Um, I mean, maybe he saw it as like a GCSE Punjabi exam. <laughs> He's like, now's my chance to flex. Maybe this nice. guy will pass me for this <laughs> thing I got to do, or he will uh, fail me to... because my Punjabi was not on point. You did a me there. You have to cut that up, by the way. Oh damn! Oh great! <laughs> oh <wait>. cheers! <laughs> wow, you did a me. There Andy you said something you shouldn't have said. <laughs> now you know how it feels. It hurts, doesn't it? I know it does. <laughs> But I'm very good now. I just know that you work in fashion. So you need you need to say something like, I work with people. Say that. Jazz works with people. Yeah. <laughs> I work with people. Fuck, you know. Well, that's broad. Right? That's it. That's the point, man. You can't guess. I work with people. <laughs> mm. 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 Um, yeah, he probably thought that you fail him or something, man. Or you, he wouldn't pass his medical assessment. Yeah, maybe. He's just He just had the vibe, man. He had the vibe in it. Like, I get a lot of these guys that come over. And the thing is, you know, I, you know, I, I didn't do this one time. Normally, I will say, like, I had the whole day today, actually half the people I saw are speaking, like, Punjabi or Urdu. I'll be like, Was he, you want to speak in English or Punjabi? I give him a choice. What would you prefer? Nice. Right. And uh, some people are more comfortable. One or the other, like, people get generally get quite happy if they can. They just relax. Like, the thing is, they don't know me. If they did know me, they know I'm really relaxed. Like, I'm not, it's not a test when you come and see me. Like, generally, it's just a... Just, you know, like I'm doing my thing, uh, but I want them to be relaxed. Otherwise, the blood pressure is going to be higher. They're going to be really tense. You know, like when I do the visual assessment, they'll start like seeing things and they'll start losing their vision and things. They, they get so stressed. Mm. So I just want to chill them out. And uh, language is one of those things. And I don't know what it is, but when you hear your own bully, you just feel like they quickly feel like this guy's my friend. And then they'll start opening up and tell me stories. Like I had one guy today and he was like, you know, I've been playing hockey for this many years and this and this and this. And, you know, they give me their life stories and it's just nice. And then they relax and then we can get into the actual, the assessment then is very easy and quick because of volunteer information. They're not stressed. It's just, it's good. Now all that comes from his language. I think someone said it once. I think, uh, I think it was Nelson Mandela. It's something, if you speak a language, somebody knows it will go to his head or something. But if you speak the language of that person, it'll go to his heart. It's like an expression like that. Um, and I actually have found that to be the case. Um, but yes, so learning point. Pretty logical, Ask the person, I'd say. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was, uh, it's, it's very good advice. The learning point is, don't assume anything. And uh, yeah, don't get yourself in sticky hot water by asking that question. Where are you? really from like where are you from that's when you did in Punjabi but in Punjabi it's, it's softer the way you really say soft. it like if you really literally soft. translate it in Punjabi you, but it's you know not why? as bad it's not and the other thing is like even if I said to you Indy 
what I could be asking you is like, where's your family from in India? Because everyone's got like a parent or whatever, like in India, like where are they originally from? Yeah, yeah. That's how you can spin it, right? I didn't mean that, but that's what you could say. But uh, it was just but a really you doubled situation. down, right? <laughs> you were like, no, no, no. The way that you think it is, is oh. the way that it actually is meant. So Correct. tell me, where are you, my friend, from? That's what you said. Kado I ate. And he's like, Mera janam ate hoya. And I'm like, okay, let's speak English. <laughs> <laughs>